team of biomedical engineers from Japan has developed a special technology that allows 3D printing of organs directly inside the human body, with the hope of simplifying future medical procedures and eventually enabling the printing of a complete human body from scratch. 3D bioprinting is a process where structures resembling natural tissues are printed using living cells and other biological materials to repair damaged organs, tissues, or blood vessels. By incorporating live cells in the printing process, these artificial structures can naturally integrate with the human body and continue to grow. The leader of the Japanese research team stated that the new device is set to revolutionize the field and could create true clones of living humans. According to him, the device is on track for commercialization within the next five to seven years, pending further clinical trials. Elon Musk's company Tesla amazed many when robots named Optimus appeared at its robo-taxi event pouring cocktails. However, according to experts, there was no real breakthrough in robot development. Everything was controlled by live operators. Attendees posted videos on social media showing Tesla's Optimus robots entertaining the crowd. They danced, talked, and even acted as bartenders. While many were impressed by Optimus's activities, especially since previous demos hadn't showcased much functionality, it turned out there wasn't much to get excited about. As with past demonstrations, Optimus wasn't acting autonomously. Tech bloggers at the event shared videos of their conversations with Optimus, where the robot, or more accurately, the human behind it avoided giving clear answers about whether artificial intelligence was being used. That said, it's worth noting that Tesla has made significant progress with robotic humanoids, and it would be relatively easy for the company to connect them to something like GPT, enabling them to communicate independently without human assistance. However, Optimus isn't the only robot marking the beginning of a new era in robotic technologies. The Chinese are also closing in on American entrepreneurs in this field. Recently, UB Tech Robotics unveiled an updated version of its latest humanoid robot named the UB Tech Walker S1. The Walker S1 is an enhanced version of previous models like the Walker X, with improved capabilities for object handling and movement. This bipedal robot is equipped with two legs for mobility and two arms for manipulating objects. Standing about 1.45 meters tall, it can interact with objects at human level, such as opening doors, lifting packages, and transporting them. Its streamlined compact design is optimized for safe movement in crowded spaces. The Walker S1 can walk on two legs and perform actions that require fine motor skills, such as gripping and moving objects. It features mechanical arms with movable fingers, allowing it to precisely and carefully lift, hold, and move packages without causing damage. Engineered Arts Company continues to release videos of its latest robot named Ozzy, which has been taking the internet by storm with its impressive ability to mimic human facial expressions. In a previous video, the robot interacted with its friend, another ultra-realistic robot named Emeka. They managed to communicate with each other using GPT-based artificial intelligence without any human intervention. What amazed viewers most was the accuracy with which they imitated human emotions. They achieved this through the use of 32 actuators, 5 for the neck, and 27 for facial control, including 12 for the lips, 2 for the jaw, 4 for the eyeballs, 4 for the eyelids, 4 for the eyebrows, and 1 for the nose. In a short clip, Azzy tells a bad joke about internet cookies, to which Emeka responds with squinted eyes and a wrinkled nose. This pair of robots was created by the British robotics company Engineered Arts, which designs humanoid robots for entertainment communication and education. You can even buy one of their creations, although the company's website notes that it costs more than a cup of coffee but less than an island. At the recent Gundam Next Future Science exhibition, visitors had a unique opportunity to interact with robotics from the mobile suit Gundam universe. One of the main highlights was the interactive experience of controlling the arm of the moving Gundam from Gundam Factory Yokohama. This 18-meter-tall robot allows participants to engage in a game of rock-paper-scissors, showcasing the capabilities of modern robot control technologies and demonstrating how similar innovations could be applied in real-world scenarios, such as space missions or disaster response. The Gundam robot was created as part of a project to bring iconic anime characters to life using the latest technologies. It is equipped with a complex system of actuators and sensors, 
enabling it to perform smooth and precise movements. Chinese engineers have unveiled an upgraded version of their humanoid robot Quavo, developed in collaboration with Leiju Robotics and Hire. This robot weighs around 45 kilograms and has 26 degrees of freedom, allowing it to perform complex movements such as walking on various surfaces, jumping up to 20 centimeters, and moving at speeds of up to 4.6 kilometers per hour. Its flexible arms and advanced control system enable the robot to pick up and move objects, perform tasks requiring precise manipulation, and handle delicate operations like household chores, including laundry, plant watering, and clothes drying. Quavo is also equipped with a powerful AI system based on the Huawei Pangu model, providing natural language capabilities, adaptation to new tasks, and integration with other smart devices. The company Booster Robotics has unveiled its new humanoid robot named Booster T1. This robot is a human-like device featuring a high level of embodied intelligence, capable of performing a wide range of movements such as push-ups, ball games, and even complex athletic exercises, including Ip Man-style squats. Booster T1 weighs less than 30 kilograms and stands about 1.1 meters tall, making it easy to carry and convenient to operate. Inside, it's equipped with an Intel i7 processor and an NVIDIA AGX Orin platform, capable of handling up to 200 trillion operations per second, allowing it to efficiently process data from sensors like a depth camera and microphones and respond to its environment. Thanks to its unique motion control system, the robot can perform various actions, from walking to getting up after a fall, and offers over an hour of autonomous operation on a single charge. Engineers from Japan have developed an autonomous robot named TruckBot, which is designed to automate the unloading of trucks and containers. This robot can unload up to 1,000 boxes per hour, addressing one of the most labor-intensive tasks in warehouses and distribution centers. TruckBot is equipped with a telescopic manipulator that can extend up to 15 meters inside a truck or container. It uses motion control systems and a multi-channel suction gripper, allowing it to handle loads of up to 22 kilograms, including packages with complex shapes. The robot is operated through the Mugen controller software platform, which enables real-time autonomous decision-making, optimizing routes and gripping strategies to improve productivity. The development took over six years, and TruckBot made its debut at the ProMat 2023 exhibition in Chicago, impressing attendees with its ability to work without human intervention. Write in the comments which of the robots shown in this video did you like the most. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave a like. See you next time.